Organ number one, the brain. It is located in the head and protected by the skull. The weight of the brain is about 1.4 kg, around 3 pounds. The length of the brain is approximately 15 cm, 6 inches from front to back. And the functions are controlling thoughts, memory, emotions, touch, motor skills, vision, breathing, temperature and many other processes because it is the boss of our entire body which has control of everything. Let's move on to the organ number two. The heart. It is located at the center of the chest, slightly to the left side. Its weigh about 300 grams, that is 10.5 ounce for an average adult. The length of the heart is about 12 cm, 4.7 inches long. And the functions of the heart like pumping blood throughout the body, supplying oxygen and nutrients while removing waste products. Let's move on to the organ number 3, the lungs. The lungs located at the chest cavity on either side of the heart. The weight of the lung is, each lung weighs about 250 to 350 grams, that is 0 0.5 to 0 0.8 pounds. The length of the lungs is, each lung is about 25 to 30 centimeter, that is 10 to 12 inches long. And the functions of the lungs are, that facilitates gas exchange, bringing oxygen into the bloodstream and expelling carbon dioxide, right? So let's move on to organ number 4 and that is the liver. Liver located upper right quadrant of the abdomen. It weighs about 1.5 kg, that is 3.3 pounds. And the length of the liver is about 15 cm, 6 inches long. And the functions are that processes nutrients from food, produces bile, removes toxins and builds proteins. Organ number 5. Dear friends, welcome back to our channel. Today you are learning about 20 most important, most major organ of the human body. Based on these organs, many questions were asked in previous exams and I'm sure that they will be asked again in upcoming exams. So watch it till end to get yourself more fit and perfect to answer any questions based on the 20 human organs. If this video is helping you, then please do like, subscribe and comment your views you are learning at the end of the video. Let's Continue. Dear friends, there is one more announcement. Dear friends, as per your suggestions, we have started a new YouTube channel where we are conducting exam or assessments based on science topics. I am sure that those videos will help you a lot to prepare for upcoming science or medical even NEET exams where we help you to gain knowledge and confidence attending plenty quizzes based on science and NEET exams. If you really want to know how confident you are in the science and medical exams, then please visit and attend the test over there. And the link of the channel has been given in the description. Let's continue. Organ number 5. The Kidneys. Kidneys are located on either side of the spine, below the ribs. The weight of the kidneys are, each kidney weighs about 150 grams, that is 5.3 ounces. And the length of the kidneys are about 12 cm, that is 4.7 inches long. And the functions are filtering blood, removing waste products, balancing fluids and regulating blood pressure. Organ number 6, the stomach. Stomach located left side of the upper abdomen. The weight of the stomach varies. Typically, around 150 grams, that is 5.3 ounces, when it is empty. 
The length of the stomach is about 25 cm that is 10 inches long and the functions are digesting food by secreting acid and enzymes, churns food to enhance digestion, so on and so forth. Organ number 7 The small intestine The small intestine located at the central and lower abdominal cavity. It weighs about 2.3 kg that is 4.4 to 6.6 .6 pounds when it is full. The length of this small intestine is about 6 meters, that is 20 feet in long. And the functions are absorbing nutrients and minerals from the food. Let's move to the organ number 8. The large intestine. And the location is, it frames the small intestine extends from the end of the small intestine to the anus. The weight of the large intestine is approximately 1.5 kg that is 3.3 pounds when it is full. And the length is about 1.5 meters that is 5 feet long and the functions are absorbing water and electrolytes and forming and expels feces. Organ number 9 The pancreas Pancreas are located at the behind of the stomach. It weighs about 80 grams that is 2.8 ounces. The length of the pancreas is about 1.5 cm. The length of the pancreas are about 1.5 cm that is 6 inches long. And the functions are produces enzymes for digestion and hormones like insulin for blood sugar regulation. Organ number 10 The Spleen Spleen located upper left quadrant of the abdomen, weigh about 150 grams that is 5.3 ounces, length about 12 cm that is 4.7 inches long and functions are like filtering blood, recycling iron, stores blood cells and plays a role in the immune responses as well. Let's move on to the organ number 11 and that is the skin. The location of the skin is it covers the entire body. Its weigh about 4.5 kg that is 8.8 .8 to 11 pounds. The length of the skin is it covers about 2 square meters that is 22 square feet in total area. The function of the skin are protecting internal organs, regulating temperature and enables sensation. Organ number 12 The pituitary gland it is located base of the brain, below the hypothalamus. It weighs about 0 0.5 grams, that is 0 0.2 ounces. The length about 1 centimeter, that is 0 0.4 inches in diameter. And the functions are known as the master gland. It produces hormones that regulate various bodily functions, including growth, metabolism and reproductive processes. Organ number 14, that is hypothalamus. It located at the brain, below the thalamus and the above the pituitary gland. Weigh about 4 grams, that is 0 0.14 ounces. Length about 1 centimeter, that is 0 0.4 inches long. And the functions are regulating many bodily functions including hunger, thirst, sleep, body temperature and emotional activities. It also controls the release of hormones from the pituitary gland. Let's move on to the organ number 15. The gallbladder. It located underneath the liver on the right side of the abdomen. It weighs about 60 grams, 2.1 ounces. 
the length is about 7.7 to 10 cm that is 2.7 to 3.9 inches in long and the functions are stores and concentrates bile produced by the liver and releases bile into the small intestine to aid in digestion organ number 16 the bladder it located at the lower abdomen behind the pubic bone and the weight of this is varies it can hold about 400 to 600 ml of urine and the length of this is when it is empty about 5.7 cm that is about 2 to 3 inches long and the functions are storing urine until it expelled from the body through urination organ number 17 the esophagus and the location of this is it runs from the throat to the stomach it weighs approximately 25 to 30 grams that is 0.9 to 1.1 ounces the length of this is about 25 centimeter that is 10 inches long and the functions are it transport food and liquids from the mouth to the stomach through peristalsis organ number 18 the thyroid gland it located front of the neck below the adam's apple it weighs about 20 to 60 grams that is 0 0.7 to 2.1 ounces and the length of this is about 5 cm that is 2 inches and the functions are produces hormones that regulate metabolism growth and development organ number 19 the adrenal gland it located on the top of each kidneys weigh about 4 to 6 grams that is 0 0.14 to 0 0.21 ounces and the length of this is about 5 cm that is 2 inches long and the functions are it produces hormones such as adrenaline cortisol and aldosterone which help to regulate metabolism immune system blood pressure and stress responses Let's move on to the last organ of today's list that is the appendix the lower right of abdomen attached to the cecum that is part of the large intestine and the weight of this appendix is approximately 5 to 10 grams that is 0 0.18 to 0 0.30 ounces and the length of this about 9 cm that is 3.5 inches long and the functions are dear friends the appendix is historically considered as vestigial but recent studies suggest that it may play a role in gut immunity and maintaining gut flora so friends hope this session helped you and added value to your preparation for your upcoming exams if the video was helpful then please do like subscribe and comment your learning from this video your comments inspire us to bring great content for you in upcoming time so thank you so much for watching see you the next time and wish you all the best for your exams take care dear friends there is one more announcement dear friends as per your suggestions we have started a new youtube channel where we are conducting exam or assessments based on science topics i'm sure that those videos will help you a lot to prepare for upcoming science or medical even neat exams where we help you to gain knowledge and confidence attending plenty quizzes based on science and neat exams if you really want to know how confident you are in the science and medical exams then please visit and attend the test over there and the link of the channel has been given in the description let's continue